We don't see where the whiskers of him walking around the streets of Bournemouth. Mm. <laughs> and ladies, and ladies, I know you're all checking out me frock. I said me frock for that. <laughs> I call this my Ikea dress. You might think, oh, look at me and me drawers fall off. <laughs> I'm not going to introduce myself. See, I work with Mr. Beast in the castle. I'm his housekeeper and cook. I am Polly. Polly LeClonk. And I come from a very long line of plonkers. Well, I'll tell you, there's my cousin, silly plonker. Yeah. Oh, me aunt, stupid plonker. Oh, me nephew, what a plonker. Oh, and me granddad, poor me plonker. Oh, here, talking of plonkers. Have you seen my son, Louis? No, Ooh, you wait till you do. Oh, he's a lovely boy, he really is. But sometimes he can be very, very stupid. Well, I'll tell you, only the other week, he sold his car for petrol money. <laughs> he thought Ed Sheeran was a barber. And only the other day, I had to take him to the doctor with a very, very embarrassing problem. But you see, I bought him a new roll-on deodorant. And he read the instructions, and he said, remove lid and push up bottom. But I do love him, and he's very, very good to me. He treats me very well. But only the other week, he took me out to this really posh restaurant. Oh, the decor was beautiful. The clientele was so sophisticated. Now, what was it called? Weatherspoon, I said. Oh, and the food, the food was marvellous. Well, the first time I went, I had shepherd pie made with a real shepherd. But the last time I went, I had a ploughman's lunch made with a real ploughman. I can't wait for tonight. It's cock a van. <laughs> and I tell you, all this thing out made me put on a few pounds. I'm on a diet. Well, actually, I'm on two. There's not enough food on one. But I tried all over the years. Oh, I tried the whiskey diet. I lost three days. I tried the cabbage soup diet. I lost three friends. <laughs> but now I go to Weight Watchers, yeah. Mind you, if me and my mates get bored, I empty a bag of Maltesers all over the floor and we play up the repos. <laughs> yeah, but I'll tell you what, diet or no diet, there's one thing this little friend's fancy cannot resist and that's a slice of cake, yes. Actually, I've just been into the petition, the, the, the bakers. And as I walked in, there in front of me was the most wonderful gattox. I've never seen a gattox like it in my life. I said to the man behind the counter, excuse me, excuse me, come here. I must say, that's the most beautiful gatherings I've ever seen. He went, no, 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 madame, no, no, no. In France, we do not say gatherings. In France, the X is silent. We say, gato, 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 gato. Anyway, how much is it a slice? He said, 20 euro. I went, bolo, bolo. <laughs> oh, oh. Look at the time. But I love standing around there chatting and making friends. I need to get back to work. I've got to prepare Mr. Beast dinner. Oh, but it's such a big job. Well, he's got such a massive appetite. Now, what did he want? Oh, yeah. Spank bowl, sausage roll, pasta, bacon, carrot cake, boiled fries, scrambled eggs. Don't forget the chicken's legs. Roast beef, cock and fat. Sherry, trifle, custard, flat. And I put some crap and take the bread and butters on his plate.
Yeah, I better go find my son Louie. I'll let you any money if you watching the football.